So it, it, it's pretty it, it's pretty hard for, for artists to make money off rap. Like that shit is, is almost impossible. It it's is. like hitting the lottery. It is. Um, but you know right now, I mean, what you got a Porsche, you got what else, the bands? Two bands, Porsche 911, um, um, 2015 drop top Camaro, um, 640 BMW, and uh, my little low key truck truck. Okay, so make is this is this rap money? It's rap money. A lot, I know a lot of people profile you and be like, ah, oh, he gotta be doing something on the side. Yeah, rap money, man. I can't do nothing else on the side, man. Like I can't, like you know, I done heard I was I was doing this shit for like twenty years. Yeah, yeah. Like, like, like you know, I done been doing this shit for like twenty years. Yeah, yeah. Like, like you know, I done been doing this shit for like twenty years. Yeah, yeah. Like you know, I done been doing this shit for like twenty years. Yeah, yeah. Like you know, I done been doing this shit for like twenty years. Yeah, yeah. And, and get whacked by some old friendly ass nigga, you know what I'm saying? You know, or, 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 or a nigga that snitched on me. My three just served me, didn't serve me. So I'm like, nah, it ain't that. It's, it's real rap money. I ain't doing no credit card licks or nothing. Shit like that. I'm real rap money. Like, so how, much, how much is a Mobri feature going for right now if I want to get you on the record? $1,500. Okay, 1500 That's reasonable. Like, yeah. a lot of dudes that are like hot. And the guy got the streets on lock, they want three to five bands. Yeah, yeah. But you're still making a reasonable thing. Yeah, I'm making it, yeah, I'm making it, you know what I'm saying? You know, cause I, I used to be broke, broke, broke to where, you know, certain kind of money like shit. I'm talking about broke where five hundred dollars was like shit. That 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 was too much. You know what I'm saying? So you know, it's it's fifteen it's fifteen hundred, it's fifteen hundred a verse. Seven thousand a show, man, you know. Okay. Yeah, so off you know, your CDs and stuff like that. Um, is this like in stores or streaming? Yeah, stores and streaming, you know. I'm on iTunes, Google Play, Amazon, Spotify. I'm on all that shit, but you know, in the city, I'm in the stores. In Austin, I'm in the stores. You know, a couple stores in H-Town, so you know. Uh, Bob and Pop stores in the country towns and Tyler's and shit. So you know, like, yeah, I, I, I get money both ways. Okay. Um, how much do you think you made, you know, total off of rap? Last time it was 80 grand. 80 grand was last time, 80 grand, you know. And, and, and shit. Now, bro, I, I can't, I don't know, man. I, can't, I got a house, bro, a big ass house, bro. That was my last investment. That's my last, what I, what I paid for, you know what I'm saying? So, do you think you probably made it with a quarter million, like 250? Did you say 250? About two? Nah, I, 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 Yeah, probably about two. I was gonna say, I was gonna say like one, one eighty five, one ninety five, or something. It'd probably be two hundred. Yeah, yeah. Now a lot, a lot of rappers, they you know, they go broke after a while because they think the shit lasts forever. Yeah. Do you have any investments? I mean, you just spoke on the house, but is it like anything outside of music that you want to like invest in, like probably a restaurant or clothing or some shit like that? Yeah, I'm trying to get you know a couple of little, little store, little CD stores, man. You know, and little music stores, you know. Bring them back, you know. It ain't just necessarily a CD store, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, try to invest in this shit. I'm gonna go buy me a, a donut shop. Okay, okay. You know, everybody gotta eat donuts in the morning, who, but who gotta eat donuts 24 hours, though? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go now. Damn, know. I shouldn't have said this. I ain't gonna, somebody gonna steal me. I mean, but you more free, though. You, if you open it, the streets gonna follow. Yeah, I mean, yeah. You know what I'm saying? A 24 hour donut shop, bro. You know, can't beat that. Yeah. You know, you go get your. Pig in the blanket at two o'clock in the morning. The pig in the blanket go hard in the bitch. I don't eat on the eat pig in the blanket. You know, you go get you there at two, two, three in the morning. You know, yeah. so you know, leave the club and go straight to the donut shop type mm -hmm. shit. You know, that's that's dope that you're thinking about investments. Cause a lot of artists, like I said, they they think that this rap shit lasts. Forever. No, it don't last, and being hot don't last neither. You know, it's always somebody coming next. Yeah. Do you feel like you reached your prime, or you, you not even giving me a prime? Nah, no, nah, no, I ain't there yet. Uh -huh. I feel like I really just got started all over again. Uh, yeah, been yeah. doing it two years and a half. So, uh, what's up with the tour, though? I mean, yeah. at least at least getting let's let's. I'm not I'm not here. I'm not doubting you, but I'm yeah. just saying like I mean I feel like we got the fan base to do a Texas tour, but what's up with like if I was to do it like under like a, a future or. I don't, I don't want to say Rock and Lucci, because y'all are, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But like, co-headline on the tour with somebody bigger than you. Yeah, you know, it's a lot of ways to make this shit happen, you know, shit. It's just, like I say, 
Serious stuff gotta happen at the right time. You know, it, it gotta go the right way. You know, we can't just go say, hey, we're gonna do a tour like this. You know, it gotta it gotta be mapped out and planned that it gotta benefit everybody, you know what I'm saying? You know. You know, I used to do a lot of stuff. I ain't saying like, you know, but I used to do a lot of stuff for, for free just cause I need to do it. I need to get out there, I need to put my face out there, but shit, like, you know, now it's like it gotta make sense. It gotta add up, you know. Mm. Like, I, everybody depend on me. So, you know, I gotta make it work. You know, on my end, everybody depend on me. So, you know, I gotta make it work for them and me. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, but like, with a tour, like you said, that Texas tour, I wouldn't even so much do a Texas tour. I, I, I feel like I can, if we start a tour, I hit the whole South region from the from the Alabama, Mississippi, Louisiana, and Texas, like, type shit. Sir, that's, that's right. Um, where, where do you, where do you rank yourself at? I mean, well, you already said you're number one in the city, but how do you feel like the, the DJs rocking with you right now, when you know the radio stations and stuff. Like that. It 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 it, it, it switched up all the way. You know, a long time ago, I remember I can remember a long time ago uh, when we was uh, when we was over there off thirty five. You asked about the DJs, and I only could name you like four or five of them. But like now, they all on board now. You know what I'm saying? Like you know. So shout out to the DJs, man. Like they all fucking with me. Especially Bay Bay at K104, that's my nigga, fool. Like, real talk, like, uh, J. Cole, you know what I'm saying? At the radio station. Uh, you know, it's a lot of, shout out to the old K104. You know what I'm saying? I met Cat Daddy, I met Cat Daddy and them up there, and uh, we chopped it up and shit, man. They, they looking at me, man, you know? Shout out Kiki J. Came to my listening party for the Foreign Diamonds with Gangsta Grizz, you know? So, I'm like, the DJs, they on board now, you know? Now your Facebook got deleted, right? DJ Duffy find that. Now your Facebook got deleted, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. Six times. Um, do you think that kind of hurt you? It did. Yeah. Yeah. Now why do you keep getting deleted? They don't see me shine. I'm, they tired of me coming down their timeline shining like that, man. Come on, man. Tired of me getting 3,000 likes and all these mother... Nigga, the last time I was on Facebook, I'm telling you, before they hacked me. Uh, I would just, nigga, we wasn't on there number 10 minutes. We had, we had 80,000 80, views already, me and Kirk O'Bain's in the studio. Kirk O'Bain came to the city, pulled up. O3, you know what I'm saying? We, we, we working, me and Kirk O'Bain are dropping that shit on the show on the beat. We in there dropping that shit, we going live. He, Kirk O, where the hell is that three, you know what I'm saying? They on here, they love you. They hack me right in the midst of that bitch, right in the midst of the, they take that bitch now. I ain't mean, got a jail. They, they take me down right in the midst of that, like, reporting me, like, you know. And I came back and tried to make other pages. And shit, after the sixth time, I said, man, fuck this shit, man. They ain't, they not trying to see me win. Mm. Fuck that. They ain't stopping nothing, though. Mm. But I ain't gonna lie, I say like it didn't hurt. Cause those were, you know, those was a lot of my followers that I had followed from everywhere. Nigga, Kansas City, Detroit, Memphis, New York, everybody, they watched their Facebook. You know what I'm saying? It, it, it go everywhere. So you can't go on Facebook. You like fuck. I ain't just out of way give up, but right now I ain't, I ain't made no face. I ain't, I ain't putting my energy. Okay, they took that down too. <laughs> they took that bitch down, is it your man. Name or what? Like, what is it? Uh, they hit me with the uh, Mo three. Mo three is not his real name, so I'm like, duh. But why would Facebook even try to make me send the ID in for that shit? Like, this is a. This is an artist page. This is. So a, why don't you just send an ID and let me know? I can't send no ID in and my name say Mo3. Then they gonna put that's not his real name. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah. Like, let me tell you, it go like this. If you got a anybody on Facebook right now, you know you got your you know you got your names like shit. Lil Kiki Camden Bands Jones, uh, uh, Sharika getting money at the strip club, Jackson. You know what I'm saying? You know they keep they, they Facebook will let them keep them names because it, it, it don't have so much activity going. But when when that one page got so much activity, like my page doing numbers. Oh, hold on, who the fuck is Mo Three? Hold on, show your ID. That ain't a real name. Damn, y'all ain't say. It's, it's a lot of people on my page that ain't the real name, but once, once you got so much activity going, you know, they they, they, they they looking at this shit, so you know what I'm saying? But like, I, I ain't gave up on Facebook shit. I want my motherfucking Facebook back. I ain't gonna lie. I miss my Instagram been turning up, yo. Yeah, it been turning up. Yeah, Instagram been turning up because Facebook is gone. So, you know, they been gravitating to Facebook. 
Yeah. So for the people watching, I mean Instagram and Snapchat. For the people watching, where can we get Four Diamonds? Say what? What can we expect from in the future? Uh, Four Diamonds, man, go get that right now, man. You know, uh, it's a mixture, it's the best of both worlds, a mo three, bro. So that's uh, y'all know I sing and rap. So you know, like I say, it's on Google Play, Amazon, Spotify, iTunes. Shit, if you want it for the for the freebie, just to look up here, just get on YouTube, the whole type on that bitch. And uh, follow me on uh, Instagram, Mo3 Badass, man. Follow me on Snapchat, Mo3 Badass, man. Twitter, Mo3 Badass, I have to sign. Uh, in the near future, man, like I say, oh, y'all got a uh, R&B mixtape no. on Valentine's Day. Yeah, my first, my first R&B mixtape, like I don't, I do an R&B song every now and then, just, you know, that's for my, my lady fan base. You know, I be singing like a bitch, you know. Uh, but I'm gonna do, I did a whole tape. I did a whole tape just straight for the females, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's dropping on Valentine's Day, kind of gangster love, you know what I'm saying? And then, uh, yeah, like I say, that shot of 3.0, that crack, it's coming, man. Yeah.